Hi, it's me, Burbingish, and ah, uh, I'm not sure why my outfit looks like- Oh, there we go, it's it's fixed now, alright, cool. Well, anyways, welcome back to the Patreon progression. This episode, we're gonna get a little lethal with our haircuts. And that's because I really need XP, bro. I'm, like, only level 12 right now. And my goal is to finally beat the Deep Crucible, which killed me last episode. And, uh, yeah, I'm not very happy about that. So hopefully by the end of this episode, I'm, like, at least level 17, and I can go back and re-challenge the Deep Crucible. You know, I just thought of something. I have not done like a Chima Complex match in like, what is it, three progressions now? I stopped doing them ever since uh, Elo dropped her chimes and I was like, eh, I don't think I should uh, ruin my chimes Elo with all these goofy, uh, goofy builds that I got, right? But you know, I should be fine right now, I am level 12 after all. And uh, I kinda just stopped caring about chimes ever since they released Iron Sing. 1 versus 1. 5 minutes later. Any second now. You know, the pool of players that they can choose from is, uh, pretty small. So they gotta be in range of, like, level 12, and they gotta be, like, around 1400 to 1500-ish elo. This is, uh, this is gonna take a second. Hello? Any low levels in this lobby? Well, uh, that didn't work. Oh, ah, why'd I hit the escape button? Bah, bah, bah. Does that always guard break? If that did, that would actually be so good. Instant guard break monsters are kind of the meta right now. There we go. Get my Gale Breath up. Nothing good in here. Alright, once I get Gale Breath 50, I'm gonna start moving over to Intelligence so I can get Overflowing Dam. And uh, honestly, just get a bunch of Ether. You know, it's funny, I get overflowing dam so that I could uh, focus on my M1s, but I also want intelligence so that I can, uh, you know, use my mantras. But I guess that is why they put overflowing dam in intelligence and not something like strength or fortitude. Gotta keep those uh, stinky attunementless players away. Oh, uh, there he goes. Hey, Master Gale Breath. Well, they leave me no choice. If I want to do any sort of PvP in this video, I'm gonna have to kill my clients. Let's see, intelligence... Oh, math training. What is 45 divided by 908? Uh, I'm just gonna guess that. Yeah, there we go. How much intelligence can I get from this? Like, how much do I have stored up? There we go. Wolverine's Claw, Chronostasis, uh... I'm gonna just take... I'm gonna take Wolverine's Claw, honestly. Okay. Freeze that. Haunt the Gale. Oh! Inhale. Bulldozer can come later, man. So since I still want to keep some of my clients alive, right, so that I don't go out of business, I'm gonna have them flip a coin, I mean choose like heads or tails, and I'm gonna flip a coin, and if they guess right, I give them a good haircut, and leave, and if they guess wrong, I give them a bad haircut, and I kill them. Sounds pretty fair to me. Oops, that's Chimes of Conflict. Amir Baranoff, if that's how you pronounce it. Let's see if you are a lucky man. Hey. Okay, chill out, bruh. Okay, man. You don't, you don't want a haircut. I, oh. Okay. This is not so great right now. I just wanted to ask if you if you wanted heads or tails. This guy clearly is not in the mood for a haircut. Oh, I hate that. Alright, hold on. This guy deals like a bar of my HP per hit. Holy bro, I did not- Alright, watch the strat. Oh, fall down there. Uh... Oh, hit him with that. I wish I had something to throw him off right now. Don't exactly got that though. Oh, I even gave him the good haircut. This sucks. I gave him the do cut. Man, I fixed your haircut, man. I fixed your haircut. Give me some mercy, bro. I don't know, maybe he liked this haircut. <laughs> Alright, so... Hopefully... Whoa! Okay, I'm dead. <laughs> Alright, come down here. Wait, hold on, hold on. I'm a bit of a finesser. Ooh. Okay, he, he's chasing me down there. Oh, he died! He died! Wait, wait, hold on. No! Wait, wait, is he gonna drown? 
Ah, uh, we, we'll never get to find out, bruh. <laughs> I didn't have a scuba drowner. Well, what a rude man. I hope he does drown. Let's see. Uh, mathematics. Back to math, like the true Asian I am. You know what? I'm gonna get the bad haircut, just in case. I'm keeping the bad haircut on me. I do have some autodidact points, so I'm gonna see if I can get my level back. There we go. Got my life back as well. Bulldozer is back. Uh, yeah, I'll take bulldozer. Gale coil. Oh, light speed reflexes. Can I get? Oh, wait, hold on. I, I actually haven't gotten the chance to really use wind passage since I haven't made a new gale build in a while. So you know what? Let me let me try it out a little bit. Let me try it out. I think I need to upgrade that with like some like uh, drift shards. Maybe I don't know. Put that on there. Do I go further now? I think that was, that was a little bit further, I guess. <laughs> I think this guy needs a haircut, bro. Like, look at that. Hold on. Let me fix you up. L let me fix you up real quick, bro. Let me fix you up. Alright. Get that real quick. Bah, bah, bah. There we go. He got that Duke slick haircut. No problem. I'm not. I'm not even gonna charge this guy. I have enough notes already. Anyways, back to my original plan. Let me fix you up. Okay. Oh hell nah, bro, man. What the hell? I'm, I'm. I'm revoking his haircut. Haircut revoked. No more haircut for you. Man, this sucks. I got like a little pineapple thing on my head now. I actually have not used the yourself feature. There we go. Ooh. Ooh, that looks kinda nice though. Uh, I don't really like how the mask kinda clips into the front of the hair though. But this looks like a very respectable barber. Re respectable barber haircut. I want haircut. Hold on. Let me find the perfect one for you. I gotta find this guy a haircut because uh, I only have like male haircuts and this is pretty pretty feminine. Oh, I'm gonna I'm give bro the- I'm gonna give bro the ghetto haircut, bruh. I'm like Jujutsu Kaisen. That's more like it. <laughs> well, uh, my void eye needs some time to recharge, so I'm gonna just head over to Hive, get myself some normal XP, and also Archmage. Please make it so that the void eye cooldown is in like five hours. I don't know what the visual cooldown for the void eye is, but it's clearly not whatever it's supposed to be. There's a lot of intelligence. Yo, what happened, bro? I barely did anything. Oh, wait, this must be the new update. This must be the new update. I made it so that I get so much more, like, this XP. Oh, that is actually so nice. Dude, all the XP I got was just coming into Fort Merritt and then getting, like, the XP off of discovering a new area. And that gave me so much intelligence. Wait, hold on. Let me walk into another area and see how much intelligence I get. You know, it might be a combination of the heavily buffed XP and just this giving a lot of XP on its own. Bing, bing. What the, hey, what the hell? They really, they really can't even run the ones, huh? Oh, that did not hit me, man. And there's a mama pressure here. Where are you going? Oh, right. Bro was just moving out of there until you just decided to teleport to me. Oh, three star. Wow, that, that sucks. Never mind. Let's see how much XP I got from that. Oh, seven points from one pressure. Well, I mean, and the Sharko, I guess. Uh, Chronostasis. Eh, I'm going to take air pressure. I'm going to be honest. Chronostasis is such like a situational uh, talent just because half of the player base runs Reaper. I don't think Chronostasis is going to help you when you're dead on the floor. Oh, well, I mean, I guess it can save your opponents, I mean, your allies from being reapered. But I'll be honest, all the opponent has to do is just run away for like 3 seconds. Alright, so if the update really is this good, I should be able to get, say, Gale Breath 65 from those two freshers. Oh. Uh. I guess not. Man, this sucks. I actually have to go get XP now. You know, I never did get to finish that uh, coin flip thingy, so I'm gonna go do that real quick. Arthur Vendet. 
Where? Oh, he left the chest. How nice. One platinum bar. All right, all right. Hey, heads or tails? Heads or tails? Heads. All right, all right. One sec. Let me go over to Chrome real quick. It's heads. All right, you get a you get a free haircut. Congrats, you get a free haircut. L l let me give bro the triangle cut. <laughs> Five minutes later. Oh crap! I just had it on the Roblox screen. All right, guys. I just realized that uh, <laughs> I just had it on the catalog screen accidentally. So here's the haircut I gave him, just in case you were curious. Ah, uh, yeah, I gotta remember to swap back to the Deep Woken screen next time. And let me go get some uh, new haircuts to play with. Pass is shell. I think he's in there. Hey. Hey. Sir. Sir, I wanna give you a haircut. Sir. No, I just wanna give you a haircut. Come back. Come back! No! Oh! Uh... Are you... No, you're not on my list. Come back! Guys, I don't know what tells me this, but I think he doesn't want a haircut. Just the subtle hints and everything, you know? Hey! Heads? Or tails? Why is this... Is this guy a Vesperian or not? Heads? Alright, alright. Let me swap over the screen. It's heads, alright. Alright, sir? You won a f oh whoops I forgot to sw switch the screen. You won a free haircut. Ching ching ching. Ah, uh, why isn't it working? Well, let me try this again. Uh, something something's not right. Oh, there you go. <laughs> You're no longer a Vesperian now. What do you think? Snazzy, yeah, yeah. Secret Void Walker in disguise. Ooh. None of my bounties have actually uh, failed the heads or tails check yet, so I still haven't gotten any XP. All right, I got a feeling that this next bounty is actually gonna lose the lose the coin flip, which is what I'm hoping for since uh, I'm a little low on XP right now. Emery Ven. Oh wait, no, I'm just seeing things. Hi, it's me, Editor Ribbingish, and, uh, I looked back on the footage, right, and I was not seeing things. Hold on, like, look at this. There was a random, like, random freshie dancing. Random da dancing freshie is right here on the board. Then, seconds later, like, I look back, right? He's gone. <laughs> what? Hi, it's me, Editor, Editor Ribbingish here, and I just noticed that there was a smoke trail of somebody just running past me and they were just gone so uh i'm not they uh, this still doesn't make sense how they just like appeared like that but uh at least we know where they went jacob theus oh i just saw some thunder over there sir heads no sir wait up wait up no sir sir come back Oh, is he gonna pit stop? No, no. Oh my god, bruh. I'm not- I'm not that scary, bruh. Like, I am a very professional looking man. Well, uh, you know what? I might as well take care of these guys while I'm here. Wait, isn't this gonna like- if he goes to another server, I'm just gonna get teleported, aren't I? Oh crap. Gotta make this quick. Before he leaves. Die. Die. No! <laughs> Gala era. Well, I am running low on food. I might wanna. If he gets a haircut, I'm gonna charge him for food. It's no longer gonna be free just because uh, uh, I said so. I think that's him over there. Let me just eat my reds and then I'll uh, conduct my businessly negotiations. Hey, heads. Oops, heads or tails. Heads or tails. Man, you don't need to be that cautious, bruh. Alright, alright. One second. One second. Oop. Uh, it's not... Wrong window, bruh. Wrong window. Alright, alright. If it's heads, I kill him. It's ta- Oh my god, bruh. Alright, alright, alright. You know what? Fine. Congrats. You win a free 
her coach. Alright, let's let's see what bro want. One sec. One sec. I gotta find find him a good haircut. Alright, I'm taking a bit too long. I'm just gonna give him the Duke haircut. Cause I uh, I'm running out of time here. What? What? Man, I just gave you a haircut, bruh. Okay, I mean, I, this is what I wanted, so I don't really mind. Okay, Gale Lunge. Hit him with the precision cuts. Light's final toll, how fun. Let me reinforce real quick. Air Force. Gale Lunge. Budget prominence draw. Oh, I thought it hit him. Yeah, no, wind passage is kind of annoying. It doesn't really hit all that much. Oh, I'm on fire. The thing has not been very forgiving right now. So, hopefully I don't screw up a bunch of my parries. Oh! Yo, Fade Trimmer combo? Yo, the Fade Trimmer combo is crazy! I just wanted to give you a uh, haircut okay i just wanted to give you a haircut and or murder you if you lost the coin flip but like that that doesn't matter that doesn't that <laughs> yeah hold on let me just close the catalog real quick anyways let me just grab all the stuff here he had a lot of stuff on him dude what the this guy had like a whole fortune on him bro like, why don't he sell some of this well that's about uh all i can carry who knew committing murder would be so much better than being a barber? 5 HP ring, 3 HP ring, uh, Conga's clutch ring, because why not? Oh wait, I can't forget, uh, 2 HP earrings, moonlit earrings, where are they? Moonlit, ah, here it is. Anything for 2 extra HP. And also, why was that guy so overly paranoid? Like, honestly, I just wanted to give him a haircut. Like, he, like, he was like, try it. And I was like, oh, okay, you want me to try the haircut? Sure. And then he just starts attacking me. Well, anyways, let me see how much XP I got from that. One point. Two point. Three point. Four points. Five points. Five points. That's, that's actually not that bad. Since I'm kind of rich after that one bounty and I have Gale Breath 60, I'm going to take a visit to Vigils real quick and upgrade some of my mantras. Oh, he, he's still here. Let me just uh, grab the rest. It's time for me to do 2% extra damage with my Gale Lunge. Here we are at Owls of Vigils. Huh. I wonder who that could be. Yeah, I should probably go... Maybe... Maybe I should go reset my rep at Etris later. Hello. Please upgrade Gale Lunge. Wind Passage. Why not? And since I'm just so rich, I might as well do Air Force. Alright. Let me just lock all these stats real quick. Forgot to do those earlier. Even though I'm not like the type to accidentally increase a stat, uh, I feel like... Oh, oh crap, oh crap, they see me. It's just nice having all your stats locked. Well, I haven't got a clue on what I should do next. Oh! Yo! Wait, wait. 21 HP helmet. That is actually really good. I'm pretty sure that's actually better than the one on my main slot. Hey, what? Ah, oh my god, they nerfed it, bruh. They nerfed my helmet as soon as I put it on. I thought they removed rerolling stats, no? How come you can still get the fake stats and whatnot? You know what? While well, we have this nice campfire right here, let's check our progress. 411 HP at level 15, I guess that's not too bad. And I have 3% elemental armor. Huh. I think... Yeah, you know, this does look pretty nice. Uh, I might want to get better armor though, just because I'm just gonna get shredded by one Eclipse Kick. Let's see, what can I get? Prophet's Cloak, I'm too broke for that. Legion Centurion, I'm also too broke for that. Alright, and these are all just starter armors. I guess all I have to do for the Hive Drone is just to get one rock, so you know what, I, I might as well get that. Let me just uh, grab this real quick. Do Voidwalkers have like buff stealth or something? Because like none of these guys noticed me. One rock, four cloth, four fiber, Hive Drone. There we go. You know, they should probably put the scissors on this side instead, because most of the time weapons actually go on here. 
I'm just gonna transmog my fancy clothes back on. You know, I got a new set of fancy armor. I'm feeling pretty confident right now. I am level 15. I think I can take on the... What's it called again? The Deep Crucible. We can go take on the Deep Crucible. <laughs> I mean, my weapon may only deal 17.4 damage. But, uh... I have a strategy. I have an idea on how I'm gonna beat this. Oh, wait. No, that's, that's a fake artifact. Anyways, I have an idea on how I'm gonna beat this, and I learned it from uh, my last attempt. Is that an artifact? Or is that just like another herbal thing? I cannot see. Holy crap, I hate snow. That's another purple thing. Come on! Oh wait, I know. People always leave their artifacts in like the little TP gate. Uh. Yeah, no, that's just another purple glowing thing. Can they fix that already? Come on. I've been feeling like Duke Arizio of this haircut and the need to search for artifacts. Oh wait, I see one. Alright, let me just stop my boat right here. Let's go. Oh, wait. Where do you go? That, that accidentally like... Wait, crap. Did I put it in my boat? It, okay, hold on. Can I... How do I... How did this manage to happen, bruh? So how am I supposed to get this thing out of the floor? I'll just despawn my boat when I get to Aresia. You know, passing by those random Etrus guards in the water, I just thought about how it would be pretty cool if we had like little, uh, little rescue missions, basically. Like there's just like a, I don't know, random NPC swimming. He's like, man, I'm kind of stuck here. Uh, if you take me back to Etrus, I will give you some XP or something like that. Did it? Did it just fall into the ocean? There, there's no way, bruh. I why would it fall into the ocean? Oh my god, bruh. Here we go again. <laughs> the deep took my artifact. Can't have crap in deep woken. All right, I'm gonna go find one piece of the Forge of Sin. Five minutes later. Man, what the? Yo, man, what the hell? I'm getting invaded. Hi. Do you want to buy food? Sure. I I'll buy some food even though I just bought some. Hold on, let me stop the boat right now. I could use a little more. Is that a honeycomb? <laughs> what? For 10 notes? You know what? Yeah, sure. Uh, here's a tip as well. Why not? Wait, 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 wait. Would you like a haircut? Alright, alright. Ba, ba, ba. Here you go. You, I've granted you my haircut. <laughs> That'll be 30 notes. <laughs> I am the bank maker, bro. I'm a bag chaser. Let's go. By the way, do you guys have the Forge of Sin? I mean, these guys look decently strong. This guy has an Evan Sphere hand axe. They could help me with the Deep Crucible. Y'all want to join me on my Deep Crucible journey? Let's go. I've recruited myself a squad of teammates. <laughs> So we got Lyric, Trigi, and La Uvis. There are no artifacts. Where are the artifacts? I just had one. But, uh... The Deep. It took it. Uh-oh, that's not good. Indeed, that is not good. Now we gotta go find another one. Now, I'll be honest, I cannot drive with the snow in the way. Is this the gate? That's a rock. And then there were two. Where did the other guy go? Oh, there he is. All right, we got the we got the entire gang together. Five minutes later. Yeah, I'm gonna be honest. I might just have the server hop. Five minutes later. The older a server is, the longer it takes for stuff to actually spawn, and this server is not looking very favorable. There are no artifacts in this server, so uh, sadly, I'm gonna have to hop servers. This is where we say goodbye. I wish you the best of luck. Goodbye. I might have lost my pirate crew of people trying to find the one piece of the forge sin of the forge of sin that's what i meant but it's fine we shall continue to persevere you know i could be saving a lot of time right now if i just like didn't drop the artifact into the depths of the ocean oh wait finally oh it took me like 20 minutes to find another artifact it is now time to challenge the deep crucible once more all right, here we go. Hello? Did I... 
Did I not put it in well enough? How's that? Oh, yep, here we go. Okay, so we're starting off with just mud skippers. I am assuming that uh, since I'm higher level, it should give me tougher mobs. Wow! Okay, I forgot about that. Man, last time the mud skippers didn't blow up. Okay, another mud skipper. It's definitely gonna gonna get harder later on since uh, I've I found that one out the hard way. I want to kill this angel quick before anything else spawns. Oh, brain sucker. There we go. Get the time to grip this real quick. Oh, all right, golems here. I'm going to wait for other things to spawn. You see, this is my strategy. I know they always spawn facing that direction. So I'm just gonna let other stuff spawn, and then I can decide which ones I want to pick off. Unless this is the final boss, which I think it is, since nothing, nothing else is spawning. There we go. Yep, that was definitely the first wave done. What's next? Oh, normal mud skipper. Alright, I think I got this. I got this one in the bag. Hopefully. Hopefully, yeah. Uh, this one's the one I can parry. Parry, parry, parry. Angel. Please die. There we go. Grab that. Another angel. Is another thing gonna spawn soon? Oh, and those are the bosses, alright. Oh, here's the Sharko. Let me wait for something else to spawn. Just a regular Mudskipper, that's fine. Angel. Oh. Alright, good thing it's another Mudskipper, because if it was like something else, that would've been a bit annoying while I was fighting this Angel. Okay. Let me deal with this brain sucker then. Okay. Does that one blow up? Okay, cool, it doesn't. <laughs> what? Hey, what? It knows that I'm gripping the angel? Okay, that's kind of crazy. I know it aggroes like whenever, uh, I know like mobs aggro whenever you're gripping the same thing, but I don't think the Sharko is an angel, I'm just saying. You can't even grip a Sharko to begin with. Alright, that should be this wave done. Yeah, here. Oh! Enchant! Alright, alright. Deal with this mud skipper. What enchant did I get? 5 HP displacement. Oh come on man. I was I was about to grip that. Another mud skipper. Another mud skipper. They're really really put giving me a lot of mud skippers here. Another mud skipper. What is this? Another mud skipper? Alright, we got the mud skipper pile. But was that it? We we just got like 20 mud skippers for this wave. And like a brain sucker, I guess. <laughs> Ow! Oh. Yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> Pretty simple wave. Uh let me loot this chest. Wait, is that it? Yeah, wait, no. The artifact's gone. That was honestly it? Dude, they had two angels ganging up on me with a Sharko and a Brain Sucker last time. This time, I had like, one Sharko? And like, one angel? I don't know, man. But like, that was not harder than the last one, bruh. But I mean, hey, I'm not gonna be mad that I beat it. <laughs> there we go. Ether Blade. Ooh, Silencer's Edge. I need that. Anything... Silencer's Blade? Alright, alright. I should have froze Maestro's Blade though, honestly. Oh, and the best Gale Mantra right now. 
Champion's Woe Throw just because it guard breaks. And that's all the XP I have for now. I am pretty happy with that card roll, honestly. I got like two really important Gale Talons and I also got the best Gale Mantra. We did a lot this episode. We gave many, many haircuts, uh, beat up some bounties, beat up the Deep Crucible, and not to mention we got ourselves a new haircut as well. If you want to be notified for the finale of this progression, then uh, you know you gotta you gotta subscribe, man. You gotta you gotta subscribe. But yep, this is gonna be the end for this video. So I'll see you guys when the finale drops. Bye bye.